I believe for every drop of rain that falls, a flower grows. And I believe that somewhere in the darkest night, a candle glows. I believe for everyone who goes astray, someone will come and show the way. I believe. I believe, I believe, okay, okay, that's enough, but I do believe, I believe this, and I really believe what I'm getting ready to say right now about land and money grab by these people that are disagreeable, Unlivable with, unhinged, and uncharacteristically evil. So, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family, and welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house. You know, I see a lot of us are laughing at what's going on in Dalton and um, with. Crazy ass Tiffany Hinier. And so most of us know this can't be normal. Okay, so there's something going on. Just like the land grab right now that's going on in Israel. Okay, see, this is what they do. And and unfortunately, of all the black and brown people, and knowing that these people are the authors of confusion, the black and brown and the indigenous people of the earth cannot get together because of white supremacy and point out who the real enemy to mankind is. It, I mean, and it don't look like me, unfortunately. It really <laughs> looks like you. And I'm saying that to say um, what's going on in Dalton should not be, you know, misconstrued or miscategorized as some, you know, Tiffany Henyard off to the races without no backing, without somebody in this great empire allowing this to go on. Because you know good and well it wouldn't take this long for somebody to pull somebody to justice who have been of breaking laws and regulations this long. Okay, so a hearing was held last week and the court froze $450,000 of the village of Dalton's bank account, which is twice the amount uh, the judgment that's against them, plus interest because the check was way tendered after the village board veto voted to pay it. Okay? Um... So, okay, we assume a seizure uh, will be forthcoming, which will, I mean, which will be served on the bank who will have no choice but to tender the amount judgment plus interest and, you know, for, for the village adults. Okay, and shut they it shut them down in one step. Now they want that town that's been all black. That's been see. This is how they operate. This is this is a white supremacy one on one move you out, put in, and sometimes the face of who's doing it look just like the people that have to be replaced. 
because we have so many Judas goats in our community, so many agent provocateurs that it's go it's hard to find somebody that's really on the up and up when it comes to politics, because it really is politics. And unless you select the person that you elect, mm -mm. and somebody said, well, that's what was true about Tiffany. It was, but she wasn't vetted good enough. Or y'all don't know a mad madness when you're looking at it right in the face. And a lot of us don't because of how we've been conditioned. Okay. Because she's a complete narcissist, and I certainly, just by the language that she spoke, my standards probably are a little higher. I want the mayor to speak better than me, to act better than me. <laughs> I'm saying, who's supposed to be a political science major and all these things? I would expect them to have a little bit more self control, but you know what? I would expect them, above all, to have character. OK, so somehow y'all dropped the ball. And how did she remain a trustee for eight years? Is out of, I can't believe it. But that's neither here nor there. It's the same land grab that's getting ready to go on. on All these cities that you watch it as having these problems, they so-called black mayors and they having these issues. Um, I want you to just check out. Who's going to be the next inhabitant of Dalton? Because they want it back. Okay? And they're going to move y'all all out like they did and, and do continuously do. Like when they build communities up on uh, just... Oof, what they do to the people in New York? Built that whole housing complex on a uh, contaminated land or, you know, just all kinds of crazy stuff that you know that they are involved in and they got a hidden hand in whatever the consequences or whatever the benefits are. And in my opinion, I don't got no proof of this other than history. It seems like that's what's happening in Dalton. That's why it's taking so long to get her out of there. And now they trying to pay a damn um, $400 an hour, which don't make no sense since it's too negative. Too, that doesn't make any damn sense when the FBI is dragging their feet so she can bankrupt the town. Then they're going to swiftly move in. Do what they got to do. That's what's going to happen. Get them out. Either they're going to have it an immigrant town now or a, a, a golf course. A whole town full of golf. They're looking at little towns like Harvey and all these little villages and suburbs of Illinois. And you will get moved out. Well, just like what was that town? Like the town in Louisiana, a Boca. I mean, this is what they do. This is what they do, and I just want you to keep an eye on Dalton for that reason and that reason alone. How long are they gonna let her get away with this? And is it gonna be until there's no more money left in the coffers at all? We'll see. Now, if you don't agree with me, or if you think I'm talking crazy, let me see your comment below. Let me see you disagree and what you got to say about it, and maybe we'll go live about it, huh? I haven't been live in a while. I hope my equipment hold up, but we'll see. Let me let me hear from you, family. Oh, 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 and let me do this too. I will be remiss not to thank. Um, all the new subscribers, uh, it's a lot of y'all, and it's some. It it, it 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 really warms my heart when I look and see you up there, and I thank you for being a member of the page. 
I thank you for supporting the channel. And we'll see you in the next next video. Okay. All right.